The Nigerian Communications Commission says over 47 million Nigerians have registered for the national identity numbers. The NCC Director of Public Affairs, E.K. Chuku Adende, says the figures represented the statistics collected by telecoms mobile operators. Adende is optimistic that many more Nigerians would be linked up before the deadline for the exercise in February. Reacting to the report, the NCC spokesman said the Minister of Communications and Digital Economy, Issa Pantemi, expressed satisfaction with this commendable achievement. He was said to have expressed the federal government's appreciation for the commitment demonstrated by all stakeholders and citizens and urged them to submit their names before the 9th of February 2021 deadline. Now, following the deadline for the linking of national identity number with mobile SIM cards, Nigerians who are seen crowded at the registration center amid the COVID-19 have expressed worry, calling for extension and more registration centers to be open to ease up the process. Jacinta Obioku reports. Nigerians seen here at the Kogi Registration Center believe the deadline date is not feasible considering Nigerians' population. They must extend it. What is the population of Nigeria? How many people have been captured? Over a million people have not been captured. So they will tell the million people that they will not use their phone again. At the National Identification Management Commission headquarters in Lagos, there are different stages of queues. Gaining entrance through the main gate does not guarantee success as the queue continues inside. We've been here three days now. What if they ask me tomorrow not to resume at my place of work just because I want to get an NIN? That our government can come up with something meaningful. It's frustrating. Nursing mothers are not exempted from the hustle for the registration. This thing is not encouraging. I'm fed up of all oh yeah. If it's not compulsory, it's only, I don't need to bring my baby down here. And here are some of their suggestions and pleas to the government to ease the process. Since we have this COVID-19 on ground, the federal government, all the names in the people in charge, should create more centers, enabling centers to enable people to register at ease. Just like uh, Pennywise found foolish, NIN should not come by this time. Because uh, I won't lie to you, the number will continue to be up. It's not all about, about prayer. Government can do better than this. They can take it online. People can sit down in their houses. We're talking about uh, shelter in place, stay at home. And people, because they want to register for a number to get to sleep, they have to come here in the morning, go away in the evening, and queue up like this and expose to all the risks. We don't have, a, we don't have yet the vaccine in Nigeria. And trying to get updates from the officials on deadline agitation, we were given the contact of the head corporate communication, NIMC, and this is what he said. We are just involved in the process, Ministry and Fush, but it's the Ministry of Communications and Digital Economy and the Honorable Minister that issued the directive since last year, February. You understand? So he is the only person that can also talk on the deadline or extension or otherwise. Detention seen here might be understandable, but it should also be a thing of worry, seeing that the preventive directives of the pandemic have been violated. From NIMC office Ikeja, Jacinta Obuku reporting for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.